Hello everyone, welcome to a LEGO Star Wars Polybag uh, unboxing and review. Take a look at set number 40288, BB-8. This is a set that contains 48 pieces. It was a gift with purchase on May 4th uh, to 6th, I guess, while well, supplies lasted, of 2018. With purchases of 75 USD or 100 Canadian on Star Wars products. So let's crack this open and see how it looks fully built. All right, here's the set fully assembled, and honestly, for a gift with purchase, uh, this is a bit overpriced of a threshold uh, for at the time. Like, this this is a poly bag that you had to spend 75 US or 100 Canadian on, and this is what you got? Like, just a cube-like ball that has a rotating head, and it doesn't even balance right. Am I making my point clear here with why I'm not a fan of this? Like, I think a few years ago, uh, prior to this, they released the buildable R2-D2, and that was cool. Making a buildable BB-8 was not the way to go. Maybe a buildable C-3PO would have been the way to go, but... Ugh, this is a mess. Like, yeah, it's caught some cool exclusive printed parts. Uh, the same dish piece printed times four all around and then an exclusive bb-8 head but <sighs> maybe this is like a christmas ornament if you want to hang it upside down like i i i thought for a second there maybe it could be used as like a sensory toy but i even i'm not liking it like it, it's just it's so weird it's too too blocky I, i'm not a huge fan of this build Let's move on to what else this set includes, I guess. Taking a look at the instructions, they're pretty straightforward and definitely a cube center. Like I said, definitely a parts pack with what's included. But hey, you can fold up the instructions in case you want to build this on the go and there's advertisements for solo sets and whatnot. Yay! As for extra parts, this is what I got in my copy of this poly bag. Overall, for a gift with purchase for May the 4th weekend, this is definitely one in the history books as the most disappointing. Like, 75 US for this. This is like a $5 poly bag that, that like, you can go to Walmart and get. Like, like... <laughs> no. This is not a gift with purchase that warrants 75 US. Just, just no. No. Maybe if they did a buildable C-3PO, that's, that's the only way, if they're going for, like, a buildable miniature character, that's like a display. This is... Ugh, just not worth it. But hey, if you really want this guy, he's going for about 20, 25 bucks in a sealed state for some reason. Pick it up if you want. I, I wouldn't recommend it, honestly. So, yeah... I guess that's my thoughts and concludes this review. Let me know yours in the comment section down below. Uh, yeah, like and subscribe. Bye.